Also, ooh, ooh, yeah. Thank you. Hey, I'm Dave. Hope you're enjoying your day afternoon and we welcome thank you for watching me. I'm at Tully's. And I'm going to be trying their lovely wow, very smoothie. The interesting thing, thing is I have no idea what wild berries is in here, so that's another plus for this I try. Don't forget to comment, like, share, subscribe if you have not been subscribed. Thanks for watching my dude stuff throughout the year. One of them being I try. So we have taste number one. I like the thickness. Uh, it's very consistent, very consistent in that way. The color, I'm kind of surprised it's a little bit darker than I would normally see a smoothie. So that's very interesting. I'm hoping if that's the case, it being as dark as it is, it has a lot of flavor. So go ahead and try to get number one. Taste number two. I can taste strawberry, blackberry, some blueberry. Here that I can taste it. strawberry, raspberry, blackberry, blueberry. I like it. It's got great consistency. It's very good. If you have tried it, let me know in the comments what you think. If you have not tried it, I would I would like to hear your opinion on it in the video. So, that is it for me right now, until the burger comes. Hey, thanks for joining me, welcome back. Uh, we have this lovely crab. Yep, I will be taking a bite Yeah, same. I was not expecting it to be hot, as in uh, microwave, but I like it. The crab dip, interesting. I don't necessarily like it, but I necessarily don't like it. I was expecting it to be cold, which threw my taste buds off. Uh, it's very rich and creamy, which is nice in the flavor of the texture. Yeah, it's possible. Let me know in the comments what you think of this crab dip. My brain can't figure out if I like it or not, so I'm going to go ahead and try this. What the cheese and interesting, it is two patties with chicken, lettuce, and onion. So we have some extra crisp. Now my thing, if anybody remembers the bacon incident of Jim Lawrence back in 2018, I had a bacon incident. And I blasted it out talking about bacon. Jim Lawrence still hasn't changed their bacon, he talked so. It's on them to fix it. But floppy bacon is something I don't like. I like my bacon crispy, literally burnt and on fire. I have not found anybody that does that. So we're gonna try their bacon. I can show you right now. Let's take a look at it a little bit closer. Maybe you can see on the camera there. It's not that crispy. So that's one strike against this burger. But that's my fault. I didn't say crispy. Set it on fire to the point where, you know, BPD, Buffalo, police and fire have to come. That's my fault. Regardless, bite number one. I like the burger. It's great. It's definitely bigger than expected. Because it's that big. It's got good flavor. I like the flavor of whatever they marinated it with. It's good. The texture is great. It's worth it. If anything, I would make the bun mint to smear. Go on the grill for like 10 to 15 seconds. But that's that's coming from a guy who doesn't like dogs, so figure that one out. So we're gonna try this lovely fries. Again, the other thing like the bacon is I love my fries. Just as crispy as I love my bacon. Again, my fault for not telling them how they like my stuff. Bite number one. Eh. It's fried. It's fried. I don't necessarily hate it. I don't necessarily like it. Fortress and not like side. Just because it's my belt. I just take this safe. And it could have been cooked a little bit more. But that's it for me right now. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to 
the one of them a comment, like, and share, subscribe, you guys not gonna subscribe. Also, hit me up on my gaming channel, Gamer for Life. I yeah, hope you enjoy the rest of your day. I have woke up that in the blue bridge. So I don't know what I like about it. Um so, Um I would have to literally unhinge my jaw like a snake would to get the burger from my mouth. Just a smad smad. Nope. Fit. One, two, three. All right.